If you're just stumbling into the program, it's Michael Sutterfield, who's our guest. He's the director of a locally made film called The Space Station, which I've gotten to see, and a whole lot of people. Gosh, there must have been hundreds of people there that weekend. Yeah, there were a few hundred people, and and honestly, it was uh, you know bad weather. We had several people who couldn't make it, and I think yeah. it could have even been larger. Uh, so we're, we're talking about maybe doing another local screening here cool. eventually and so that the rest of them can see it. I forgot so. about the bad weather that weekend. You're right. It was crummy. It was raining <laughs> and blowing. It was bad. But it didn't stop them. They still came out to Market Street to see it. And, yep. uh, and so it was wonderful to kind of see that place off. It was a good space. Yeah, I was uh, real happy to have been there. Well, let's talk about the process of film festivals and submitting a film to film festivals. You know, for a long time, uh, casual movie fans knew about Sundance, and that was probably it. But then, bang, all of a sudden, Little Rock has a film festival. And then you start thinking, there's festivals all over the world. That's right. And that's where we want to put the film. Yeah. Uh, we're submitting all over the place, but it's really expensive. Um, you've got fees, you know, as I said before, 20 to $70. Um, and so, but there's different mar- markets and niches everywhere. So you've got, um, you know, sci-fi film festivals, short film festivals, feature film festivals, uh, fashion film festivals, anything mm. you can think of. And so uh, there's a large market out there and, and we just want to be a part of that. And is it a matter really of getting a copy of the film to the programmers and they watch all these hundreds of submissions and then make their decision on the program that they want to put? Yes. So they'll take uh, usually several forms. We're using Without a Box, which is a filmmaker tool uh, where you have your synopsis and what the film's about and you can upload a link to watch the film there. Oh, okay. And so the festivals will go to Without a Box to look at film submissions and then they also take DVDs. And so we're sending DVDs out and they pop the DVD in and they're DVD player and they watch them all. So that would be a great job to see all those. Yeah, no kidding. (laughs) It's like all the food network I watch. I want to be one of the judges. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) Those those are great jobs. (laughs) Absolutely. Yeah. All all the talent that you would see, all all the great films. There's there's so many great filmmakers out there that are submitting. So it's a very competitive market and and we just want to be a part of that community. So we want to get the film out there. And we realize that there are a million great films out there and great filmmakers. And so uh, we're just going to be glad to be showing alongside them. Yep. Well, well, that's where your money will go, everybody, the, on the Indiegogo.com uh, site for the uh, Space Station uh, project. You'll be able to see a little breakdown, which I thought was really cool because you just say, you know, right up front, there's a couple of percentage points that are going to go to administrative costs. That's it. And then here's the other stuff that we're going to use this money for. And the vast majority of it is to get the movie out there so that people can see it and uh, get it into film festivals all over the place. I know you've mentioned Austin in Texas and Warsaw, Poland. I mean, that's yeah. a pretty big <laughs> stretch right there. That's right. We've got locations all over the world that we're hoping to submit to and, and get into. So, um, But it takes a lot of submissions in order to get a good run of festivals because it, it doesn't, doesn't even necessarily come down to it being a good film or not. It, a lot of it has to do with the time slot that they have available, the genre of the film. So a lot of great films that they really enjoy, they'll end up turning down um, just due to that. And so they say, please come back again next year submit again we really like your work um you know we wish you luck in the festival run and so you have to submit to a lot of festivals in order to find the the ones that you're the right fit for yep well good luck to you thank you i hope it works out and you get into a a whole big number of them because it really is a a fun excursion into filmmaking and it was done primarily right here in little rock and you've referred to and used the phrase community driven uh, piece of art here a number of times and that honest to goodness is really what the space station film is that's right and that's the that's the only reason why it was able to be made if we didn't have countless volunteers donate their time and energy creativity uh, whatever it was um, that's what made it happen you know we had a dream we wanted to make that dream happen and and it took all of the community to put that together and that's what's happening right now at the festivals so um it's up to you guys to to help us out here on indiegogo and and so far it's been fantastic so um well, hopefully anybody who has ever bought a ticket and seen any of the stuff at the Little Rock Film Festival, anybody who's ever had friends or maybe you yourself have been involved in one of the 48-hour film project uh, um, works uh, or gone to see them, please be a part of this Indiegogo uh, campaign for the space station. We'd really, really like to see this film get out there. And I don't want to sound like I'm begging, but, you know, it's it, there is a time frame here. We're not, we're not talking about, oh, maybe I'll do it around Christmas because by Christmas it'd probably be too late. That's right, yeah. Uh, 
um, we're actually our campaign ends on July 22nd. Okay. So um, you've got a limited window here to donate and be a part of it and to get an early copy of the film and mm -hmm. you can get a signed poster. Uh, there are all kinds of great things that you can become involved with it. But anyone who donates will definitely be a part of our team. Uh, we're putting credits on the film, adding people in. So uh, we just want you to know that you can still be involved and you still have time. So, but you just go to spacestationfilm.com and that's where you can find out more. All right, great. Well, I hope you do that this weekend and uh, you can expect to see some posts on the uh, Facebook pages and websites of the radio stations uh, helping to remind you as we get close to that deadline of July 22nd. 22nd. Okay, so we still got about uh, maybe 10 days from now. Michael Sutterfield, director of the Space Station Film, has been our guest on the show this morning. I sure appreciate you coming in here. I know you're a busy guy. Tom, thanks for bringing me in. I appreciate it. It was you great. Bet. Absolutely. That website again is space spacestationfilm.com and it'll take you right to that Indiegogo uh, page that we've been talking about. Uh, thank you so much for listening to the program. Hope you enjoy uh, the guests that we have here. I know I always do and it's been a pleasure talking to Michael Sutterfield this morning. Hang around. we got more coming up in just a minute.